Hello everyone and welcome to Explore Math. Today we have to solve the problem is square root of square root of 121 minus square root of 120 is equal to what? So let us see the solution. So here in first step we will write square root of this square root of 121 can be evaluated in this way 121 is equal to square root of 11 squared and now this square root will cancel this square and it will be equal to 11 so now here we can write we can substitute this square root of 121 with 11 minus square root of 120 and now to evaluate this value square root of 120 we will factorize this number 120 here so by index form First, it will be divisible by 2. So, here it will be 60. And again, it will be divisible by 2. It will be equal to 30. And now, again, this is divisible by 2. That will be equal to 15. And now, it will be divided by 3 and equal to 5 and here is 5 so 5 is prime number so it will be divided by itself so now here we can make pairs of these factors in this way here we can write 120 is equal to 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 times 3 is 6 times 5 so now here it will be equal to square root of 11 minus square root of 120 is same as 4 times 6 times 5 or in next step we can write square root of this 11 can be expanded in two numbers like 6 plus 5 minus this 4 is same as 2 square and 2 square will be out of square root in the form of 2. So here left will be square root of 6 times 5. They can be written as separately in this way square root of 6 times square root of 5. So now here what will we do next is we will let a is equal to square root of 6 and b equal to square root of 5 so now here a square will be equal to 6 and b square will be equal to 5 and now By substituting the values of a, a squared, b and b squared in this expression, the expression will be equal to square root of 6 is equal to a squared plus 5 is equal to b squared minus 2 times square root of 6 is equal to a times square root of 5 is equal to b so now here we can see that this is a form of an algebraic formula so its closed form will be a minus b whole squared 
and the whole term is under the root and now this square root will be cancelled by this square and we are left with a minus b so now here we will recall that as we have assumed a equal to square root of 6 minus b equal to square root of 5 and that is our final answer i hope you would have liked the video please subscribe to my channel for more videos thanks for watching bye